Have you ever tried creating a 3D environment and you ended up with the results looking like this? Most people think that in order to create good 3D environments, you need to be some sort of a node wizard. And that really sucks. Seeing and imagining things perfectly in your mind and not being able to achieve those results is really frustrating. But here's the catch. It doesn't need to be like that. There is always a solution and a way to learn and we've all been there. This course will teach you how to create realistic looking environments in Blender. First you will start by learning how to use displacement to create realistic looking terrains. What is displacement? How it works? How to shape your terrain in order to look realistic? How to use nodes? All of those stuff will be explained thoroughly throughout the course so that you won't have to struggle with these concepts again in the future. Then we will move to add trees to the scene. And instead of wasting your time looking for some good trees on the internet, you will learn how to create your own custom trees easily in Blender. And here's the thing, I will also give you a little secret that will allow you to render millions of trees with no trouble. Then we will move on to finalizing our scene. And here's beside all the stuff that you will learn about shading, lighting, weight painting, how to use geometry nodes, which I will promise you will be real fun. We will also focus on how you can optimize your scene and how you can add things that you thought that will take a lot of time to render but there is also a way of how you can do them without increasing your render time like atmospheric elements. And at last you will learn how you can use layers when it comes to rendering which will allow you to render any scene in Blender no matter your computer specs. And we will finish everything by doing our compositing work and harness the power of Blender Compositor. And actually you will be surprised surprised of how much you can actually get just using Blender Compositor. The goal of this course is to get you up and running when it comes to creating 3D environments in Blender. But I think the most valuable thing that you can get out of this course is to learn the logic and the thought process of how you can approach your future projects. And honestly, I don't care that much about the final result that you will get out of this course. As much as I want you to learn the tools and techniques in the course to take your skills to the next level, which is the thing that will make me happy. Now, if all of that sounded exciting for you, I cannot wait to see you inside the course. Peace!